I believe that I have been scammed and my and my supporters' money has been stolen. <music> Greetings, owners of fine luxury cardboard rectangles, and welcome to a video I wasn't expecting to make. Actually, I had something else planned for today, but unfortunately, it turns out that I have to be talking about maker support. This is really, really unacceptable what's going on right now. Basically, I feel like my money and my fans' money have been fucking stolen. What's going on is maker support for the whole month, basically, has been hanging on to people's money. Nothing's been going down. A couple of weeks ago, uh, like around April 12th, they said that they were conducting a routine review. Like they said, Stripe's conducting a, re a routine review of the platform and has put a short hold on payouts, okay? And then they pretty much didn't say anything for a few weeks aside from just saying like once a week we're going to say something shortly like they did there was no communication whenever anybody tried to contact them they didn't explain to us anything other than a short hold on payments that'll be four to five days okay now flash forward to today about three to four hours ago maker support sent out a series of tweets and it's saying basically it says, a few weeks ago, Stripe indefinitely disabled payouts for creators. Now, two weeks ago, they told us it was four to five days. They're not being honest with us. And so I don't even believe this here. It's just like, okay, I believe the indefinite part. But what I'm saying is because of this now, it totally damages their credibility. And what they're going with is absolutely absurd. What they're saying is we're temporarily disabling the creation of new donations on Maker Support. Existing pledges will not be renewed on May 1st. In May, we will be launching a redesign of Maker Support using another payment processor. Guys, there's no way to delete your account. There's no way to remove anybody from this. A week ago, I tried to go and remove everybody from my Maker Support account. I can't. I tried to close the whole thing down. I can't. I have no ability to shut it down. Basically, they have me in lock. They have my bank information. I can't delete it. I can't delete the account. I literally have no power. It has my fans' information, my su my supporters' information locked in as well, unless they delete it. You guys, you have the power to delete it. So please, I see some of you saying in the comments, what do I do about maker support? And I've said, please delete it. But then when I go and look, it looks like you're still on there. So please, guys, if you're on maker support, get off of it. They're saying that Stripe is holding the payments for 90 days, at which time the creators will be able to make a payout. However, we have a few ideas which may speed this up. I don't believe them at all. They're saying they, they're throwing everything they can at the, at the wall right now. They say that um, there's some evidence of a coordinated attack on maker support to harm our relationship with Stripe. We'll look into this and we'll release evidence if it's confirmed. It says, you say there's some evidence and then you say you'll release evidence if it's confirmed. Show us something. Show us what's, there's some evidence. So we believe anything of what you're saying. There's no communication whatsoever. And it's so frustrating to me because God, this was just meant to be a way to get help as a creator, not to cause stress. This is absurd. The company is trying to string it out for another three months and they have people's credit information, credit card information. They have my bank information locked up. They've done chargebacks on people and now they're just like, oh, hold up for, th for three months. It's gonna take three months for us to get the money from these guys. But in the meantime, in two days, we're gonna stop charging people. And then we're gonna re we're gonna relaunch with a new pay provider. Well, what are you gonna do then? Are you gonna process the pledges? Are you gonna take people's money? Are you gonna force them back onto that? Like, there's no communication. It's just these random little things that are like they're running. A, it's I feel like they have the money and they're just running as fast and as hard as they can with it, hoping to keep as much as they can before inevitably the whole thing just crashes to the ground. I don't believe this is genuine anymore. I don't see anything to think. I don't, like, here's a work in progress screenshot of the new update. Look, we're updating our interface and, oh, we need to, we need to hire more people. We'll also be raising funds in the near future to hire a full support team. I'm glad you'll be fucking fundraising. Good. Get me my voice. Why don't you just use the money you're stealing from us for Christ's sakes? The hardest part of our job is keeping up with support because apparently the hardest part of your job is getting us the fucking money, which is the only part of your job, you fucking idiot. Whoever fucking runs maker support is a fucking inept tool who is not meant to be doing this shit. Oh my God. I feel like such a fucking retard for signing up for this. I'm genuinely sorry to anybody 
who followed me over on Maker Support. From now on, it's only Patreon. Please, if you're on Maker Support, get over to Patreon. For the love of God, just get off the Maker Support. I can't believe that I'm locked in. There's literally no way to close your account. I looked everywhere, and there are multiple comments from people who are talking about how they just can't close their account. We have no ability to do that. They're overhauling the interface. We have no control. We can't shut it down, and it's going to take... Uh, I, I don't know what's going to happen in a couple days, guys. So please... God, if you're on Maker Support, I've said this in other videos, but I'm making this one specifically because I went and looked today and a bunch of you are still there. Please, please leave Maker Support. I don't want them to steal the money. I mean, I have to say because I can't say with absolute certainty, I'm not stating this as fact. It's presented as my fucking opinion of what's going on. But I genuinely believe this is a goddamn fucking scam at this point. Maybe it started out legitimately, maybe, and then the guy just decided to do whatever. But at this point, I do not think this is legitimate anymore. I don't want anything more to do with it. So please, everybody get off of it. Because once I see it drop to zero, I don't have to worry about anything but them fucking with me anymore. And them fucking with me is one thing. Because that's fine. I'm the one who got us into this. But them fucking with you guys is not okay because it's my fault I led you there that makes me responsible for it so in closing please please get off of my maker support if you want to get to my patreon fine if you don't want to after this I don't blame you I made a mistake I fucked up my bad okay sorry about that it's frustrating sorry I don't have a funner video right now but I'll tell you what we're gonna have a fun live stream later on to make up for it this is ridiculous for those of you who have my back, for those of you who followed me over to Maker Support, thank you very much. I'm sorry that I failed you in this regard. I didn't realize what I was getting us into. Anyways, I'm out. Please don't sign up over there. Get the hell out and have a good one, friends. We'll see you later today. You know, Mana Screw, it might not be uh, totally real. It could just be random chance, dimensional portals, loopholes, time shifts, things like that, you know. But, um, uh, excuse me, but uh, uh, one thing I do know, uh, together uh, we are the sixth color of magic. <laughs>